leaving Gouda train station on my bike ride to Udwater in the province Utrecht. Gouda is a city and municipality in the east of the province of South Holland in the Netherlands with 73,181 inhabitants, January 1, 2019, source, CBS, on an area of 16.92 square kilometers. The city is located in central Holland and in the urban area of the Randstad, roughly equidistant from Rotterdam, Utrecht, and The Hague. Gouda has a regional function within the Green Heart, where it is the largest city and the second largest municipality in terms of inhabitants, after Alphen on Den Rhein. In terms of population, it is the 48th municipality of the Netherlands and the 12th municipality of South Holland. Gouda is located at the confluence of the rivers Gooi and Holland Sea Isel. Thanks in part to inland navigation on these rivers, Gouda grew into an important city in the Middle Ages. In 1272 the city received city rights and at the end of the Middle Ages Gouda had grown into the fifth city of Holland. In the city center you can still find a large number of historical and monumental buildings, of which the Town Hall and St. John's Church are probably the most famous. The city is also known for its Gouda cheese, which is traded on the Thursday tourist cheese market in the summer. Finally, Gouda is known for the manufacture of candles, pipes, Gouda pottery, Stroop Waffles and the Annual Candle Night. Audi Water is a municipality and a town in the Netherlands. The origin of the town of Audi Water is obscure and no information has been found concerning the first settlement of citizens. It is also difficult to recover the name of Audi Water. One explanation is that the name is a corruption of Old Water Meadow. 
Audi Water was an important border city between Holland and Utrecht. Audi Water, meaning Old Water, was of great strategic importance. The town was granted city rights in 1265 by Hendrik van Vianden, the Bishop of Utrecht. Audi Water took its place in the First Free States Council in Dordrecht on July 19, 1572. Audi Water was one of the twelve cities taking part in the first free convention of the States General in Dordrecht. This was a meeting that laid down the origin of the state of the Netherlands, as we know it now, under the leadership of the House of Orange. This happened at the beginning of the Eighty Years' War, 1568-1648, when the Netherlands were still part of the Spanish Empire. After a siege of Audi Water, the city was conquered by the Spanish on August 7, 1575, and most of its inhabitants were killed, including the family of famous Audi Water native and Protestant theologian Jacobus Arminius, 1560-1609. In the 16th and 17th century, Audi Water was an important producer of rope. In the surrounding area, hemp was cultivated. There still is a rope manufacturing plant and a rope museum in the town. In 1970 the municipality of Audi Water moved from the province of South Holland to the province of Utrecht. Audi water is famous for the Hicks and Weig, which is scales. This weighing house, an official town building, became famous at the height of the European witch trials of the 16th century because people accused of witchcraft were offered a fair chance to prove their innocence as opposed to many other places where the scales were rigged. From all over Europe people made the journey to Audi water to avoid prosecution. After the weighing, they received an official certificate proclaiming them not a witch. Nobody was ever found to be an actual witch in Audi water, though the weighings were still a public spectacle. Certificates would state that the body weight is in proportion to its build. The reasoning behind this is the old belief that a witch has no soul and therefore weighs significantly less than an ordinary person, 
This distinction would supposedly allow the witch to fly on a broomstick. In early modern times, when accusations of witchcraft could result in being burned at the stake, the town of Audi Water offered the accused a chance of proving their innocence. This can be seen as a sign of the growing power of the citizenry as a third force next to that of the church and nobility. Before witch hunts were sanctioned by the law and the church in their bid to break the power of local herb doctors and midwives. By giving out these certificates the citizens of Audi Water, therefore were defying the church. The WAG is still open as a tourist attraction, and official certificates are available. The town hall dates from 1588 and features a stork's nest. Audi Water has a monumental protected city center with more than 250 protected houses. The church, now Protestant, dates from the 15th century. Its tower is from about 1300. During the religious wars, until the sacking of Audi Water, both Roman Catholics and Protestants used this church. Thereafter Catholics were still tolerated, the Spanish occupiers being Catholic, but more in low profile.
Audi Water is the setting for the 1975 novel Das Geheimnis de Baron Audi Water set in the 16th century, when the Netherlands was fighting for its independence from Spain. Written by the German author Albert Rommel, it has been described as a romantic historical novel. The 2014 film Reckless was filmed in Audi Water. Gouda has long been referred to under other names as Gold, Digoud, Turgoud, and Turgu, all referring to the river Gui. Dagui was first mentioned in a charter in 1139, under the Latin name Golda. This discussed new mining on the Gui, Nov culture juxta Goldam. A certificate from 1178 speaks of Terum quandum juxta Goldam, sure land on the Gui. There are various theories about the origin of the name Gui, but none of them are conclusively established. The name could be derived from the general name Shire for a river with a road along it. According to another theory, the name refers to the golden glow that the water of the Gui, once a peat stream, had. Golda could have originated from the Germanic Golda, Gold, plus Awo, natural watercourse and sea clay area. This glow was then caused by the peat visible through the clear water. The name gold, which was common until then, was transformed in the Middle Ages into goud or turgout. In medieval Latin texts, the name was written as Gouda, meaning both the river and the city. Partly thanks to humanists and historiography, the Latin name eventually replaced the name form Turgoud, which was still in use for a long time. Nowadays Gouda is the only city in the Netherlands that is officially and popularly referred to by the Latin name form.
Despite the large number of products that are strongly linked to Gouda, the city does not have a well-known nickname. People sometimes talk about the cheese town, referring to the Gouda cheese, but this nickname is not only reserved for Gouda. Another nickname is the Guastad, after the river to which Gouda owes its name and existence. This name is also reflected in the name of the regional television channel RTV Guastad. Wadink scene which lies northwest of Gouda and is also located along the Gowi, is sometimes referred to as the Gowi village. Gowinars are also called Koskopen, a spot name that is also used for Alkmaarders and Dutch people in general. This name may have its origin in Stalwijk and would not have been derived from the cheese itself, but from cheese barrels manufactured by so-called head turners. In conflicts, these cheese barrels were placed on the head as a helmet. Hallo, bedankt voor het kijken naar deze productie van JN Productions. Ik hoop dat u ervan heeft genoten. U kunt abonneren door op de logo in de rechter benedenhoek te klikken. Alvast van harte bedankt en tot ziens.